Oxidation and Reduction, Oil Rig, by kscience.com. Oxidation and reduction can be remembered by using oil rig, where oxidation is the loss of electrons and reduction is the gain of electrons. So if you ever need to remember what is oxidation, what is reduction, just write down oil rig and then figure it out like this. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. So because oxidation is the loss of electrons, we're going to focus on how an atom loses electrons. Here I'm drawing the electronic configuration of a lithium atom where the atom has two electrons in its first shell and one electron in its outer shell. Oxidation takes place when the lithium atom loses one electron to become a lithium cation. And I'm writing plus E minus to represent the electron that has been lost. So we know oxidation has taken place because this lithium atom has lost one electron to become a lithium cation. Whereas reduction is the gain of electrons. So if this lithium cation gained one electron to become a lithium atom again, this is an example of reduction. So in this example, the lithium cation has been reduced because it has gained one electron to become a lithium atom. Oxidation and reduction aren't just to do with the loss or gain of electrons. There's another way that you need to understand what they are. This way is, oxidation is the addition of oxygen and reduction is the removal of oxygen. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. So when magnesium reacts with oxygen, magnesium oxide is formed. This is an example of oxidation because the oxygen has been added to the magnesium to form magnesium oxide. And by added, I mean oxygen has formed a chemical bond with magnesium. The balance symbol equation is Mg, S for solid, plus O2, G for gas, reacts to form MgO, S for solid and we put a big two in front of the Mg and a big two in front of the MgO. Now we already know reduction is the removal of oxygen from its compound. And this takes place when the compound is either heated with carbon or heated with hydrogen. An example of reduction by heating with carbon is lead oxide plus carbon reacts to form lead plus carbon dioxide. The balance symbol equation is PBO, S for solid, plus C, S for solid, reacts to form PB, L for liquid, plus CO2, G for gas. An example of reduction using hydrogen is tungsten oxide plus hydrogen, reacts to form tungsten plus water as steam. The balance symbol equation is WO3, S for solid, plus H2, G for gas, reacts to form W, S for solid, and H2O, G for gas. And we put a big three in front of the H2, and then a big three in front of the H2O to balance the equation. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Pause the video here to practice the keywords. The answers will follow. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. If stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers. 
and make any corrections to your mistakes. And don't forget to visit kscience.com for more videos, worksheets and quizzes at kscience.com. And don't forget to like and subscribe.